The general rule when we have equations with brackets is to nearly always expand the bracket first, though there are the occasional exception. But in these ones we'll expand the brackets first. So 5 bracket x plus 2 just means times the bracket by 5. So 5 times x is 5x and 5 times 2 is 10. And this just equals 11. We then use our normal equation solving techniques to get x equals. So I first of all take away that 10 to cancel it out. So 5x will equal 11 take away 10 which is 1. I then divide by 5. So x will equal 1 divided by 5, or 1 fifth, a fraction. For the second one, bracket again, so we expand the bracket. I times both things by 3. So 3 times 2x is 6x. 3 times 5 is 15. There's a minus there, so it's minus 15. And that just equals 7. I then must add the 15 to cancel the minus 15 so 6x will equal 7 plus 15 which is 22 I then divide by the 6 so x will equal 22 over 6 which cancels down to 11 over 3 So the rule is to expand the bracket first, and this rule still applies in the third example. We don't do 3 plus 2. The 3 is not times in the bracket, only the 2 is. So I begin by expanding the bracket. 2 times 3x is 6x, and 2 times 4 is 8. That's the bracket part worked out. There's also a 3 there, so it's 3 plus this bracket part, and that equals 8. The next step is to simplify. A 3 plus an 8 is 11. So 11 plus 6x equals 8. And we then solve the equation as normal. There's an 11 there, so I take away 11. And I'm left with 6x equals 8. Take 11, which is minus 3. Then I need x equals, so I divide by 6. So x equals minus 3 over 6, which is the same as minus 1 half. So the golden rule is always expand the bracket first. And if necessary, you can then simplify before solving.